Well, hi there, Pluckers. I have a sore fingers again with you. Thanks, Cindy, for joining me for another guitar lesson. This one is in response to a request I've had to do a lesson on a song called Old Man, done by Zach Bryan. Okay. Standard tuning, but I do have a capo on the second fret. Puts us into the same key that Zach Bryan performs this song in. Okay. So without more to do, I'm going to go through the intro. Uh, obviously, I want to be playing the harmonica bit. Okay. The first verse and the first chorus, and then I'm going to break that all down for you and show you exactly how I played it, and you will have the song sorted. There's more verses and choruses to follow, but they are played exactly the same as verse one and chorus one. Okay, singing as usual for reference only. Uh, apologies in the head for my phrasing on some of this, uh, the ly lyrics on this song. I'm, I find it quite difficult to phrase it like Zach Bryan. Okay, so here we go. <clears throat> Stories of you back in your prime when you held all the pride in your hands stained. When you go work for food, crumbs and dirt so your kids could stand for that name. And you told me some of the things that be done when you're older and stronger like me. And you give me all you have to cheat just to get dead. And the mouths that you fed at your door Old man, the sweat that you support Proves that you don't have to make it like you more Old man, the numbers you miss So your daughter could eat at this table Okay, so that's basically it. Okay, so let's break it all down for you. That's all the, as far as I can tell, that's in the song. Okay, just more verses and choruses to follow. So it starts off the introduction. It starts off in an A minor, and you emphasise the open A string, the fifth string. And what it is, it's like a progression from uh, A minor up to the C chord, but you have to. But you have to keep the A minor as it is, but then raise, the, put this here, second finger, on the second fret of the A string. So, okay, and then the C chord, emphasising the fifth string each time. Okay, that sort of thing. Okay. All the way through the song, basically, all through the way through the verse, I think. And on the intro, uh, after he's gone to the C, he goes. There's a little bit of a strum in between each chord change there. What he's doing there's a. Okay, and that's a. You on the C chord, you. You open up the third string, or you open string, the open third string, and you hammer into the second fret on the third string with that second finger. Okay. Then play the third string and the second string together, and then open again. Open third and first finger on the second string. So, and then play that second on the fourth. Okay along with the open third. Okay, so what you've got here is... Okay, got that? I'll play that solely for you. Got that? Once more slowly. Got that? 
and then we go to an F bar chord, the way he plays it, and then a G, just a single, uh, to start on the intro, first time round, just a single sweep on the G chord, okay? So the whole first phrase is... Got that? Once more for good measure. Okay, you can play a G like that if you like. I just have to play it like that. Okay, and then you've got this... Uh, What that is, is you play the third fret of the top E string, then you hit it, you hit it again and slide up to the fifth fret, and then you hit it again and slide up to uh, the seventh fret. I think that is. Is that one, two, three, four? No, hang on, eighth fret. Sorry, <clears throat> three, five, seven. Yeah, eight, eighth fret from the capo. Tenth fret, tenth fret in real life. Okay, okay, so. And then the open E string, top E string, okay? Got that? Okay, so what you've got there is, from the beginning, is... And then it repeats. It repeats the uh, sequence A minor build up to C, hammers, F, and this time it's, you carry on strumming the G this time, okay? And then you hammer, open up that fifth string on the G chord, and then hammer into it, okay? That sort of thing, okay? So, and that's the intro, so just the, the first time you've got this and the second time you just go into the G and then you can go and you can do it, you can repeat the whole thing if you want because he goes he comes in then with the harmonica, okay, which is played over the same thing again, it, just just the chords, none of this it doesn't do it twice, he only does that once, okay, but he just plays the chord sequence twice and the harmonica on the top of it. So uh, I just suggest you do once, once through like this. Heard all the stories of you back in your prime. Okay, you just go straight into the verse after the second time. Okay. So you got that. So the verse is exactly the same as uh, the build up. I go on the A minor to the C, the F, and then the G, and then the hammer on the G. But there's no uh, there's no hammers. When you get to the C, there's none of that during the verse. It doesn't play that during the verse, only during the instrumental bits, okay? So let's go to it. And the verse is exactly the same sequence. A minor, build up to C, F, G. All the way through, okay? That's all there is in it, okay? So uh, for the verse, it's the same sequence as the uh, intro, okay? So here we go, I'm gonna do the intro now and then go into the first verse, okay? Slowly, okay? And 
then goes into the chorus. Okay, you got that? So it's the same sequence as the intro all the way through the first verse. Okay, then it goes into the chorus and it goes into so it stays on G for a couple of bars on, after it comes out of that. Uh, die a thousand times just to be. He doesn't act, I don't think on that one he doesn't actually do any hammers on the G. I think he just plays strums the G for about two bars. Okay, and die a thousand times just to please. Right, and then he goes into the chorus, which is F bar chord. Oh man, the G, blood that you bled, and uh, and then we does the A minor climb up again. Mouths that you fear that you adore. Okay, so it's F. Oh man, the G, blood that you bled, and the A minor build up. Mouths that you fear that you adore. Repeat, F, O, and G, sweat that you pour, push the build up on A minor again, but that they'll make them like you no more. And it stays on C for an extra bar at that point, I didn't do it during my demo, but I think on the, if you listen to Zach's playing, he stays on C a little bit longer before he goes back to the F for another old man bit, okay? So from the beginning of the chorus, Oh man, the blood that you bear, and the mouth that you fed that you adore. Oh man, the sweat that you pour, proves that you don't make them like you no more. And oh man, the dinner's missed, and the daughters could eat at this table. hammer on that, open that second finger up on that C if you like. And then go back to the intro. Back into another verse. Da, 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 da. Okay, and that's it. That's all I can tell you about that one. That's uh, that's it. Thanks very much for watching this, Tim, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.